What is up guys? Today we're going to be going over how to get all of Genesect's drives in Pokemon Sword and Shield Crown Tundra DLC. So, let's get into it. So, first off, if you come to your map, you'll go to Stow on side. It's the town that has the uh, the auction on it. And the person you can buy your other legendary items from. Whenever you spawn in, you'll come right over to him. Now, if I look at my party, I have a Genesect in my party. You don't have to have him in your party. You just have to have him within your Pokedex or in one of your boxes, it, pretty much in your PC. So you come up to the guy in the middle and then you'll just talk to him while you can take them. So he gives you the Douse Drive, gives you the Water Type, gives you the Shock Drive, which will give you the Electric Type, Burn Drive, gives you the Fire Type, then the Chill Drive, which gives you the Ice Type. Now, whenever you equip Genesect with one of these, it changes his Techno Blast and will kind of change his appearance. So if we go into the bag here, it'll spawn in your other items. Now they'll be all down at the bottom. You only you only get one, but you can swap in or out. It's not you use it and that's it. So if you saw the Genesect before, he had kind of like this tannish drive within this back. We'll go ahead and give him the shock. Uh, no, we'll give him the douse drive. So give him the douse drive because you'll kind of be able to see the most. If you looked at his little icon, now he has a little blue slit in his back. And if we inspect him, he now has blue on his back. And what that does is we'll go to the summary. So it says he has the douse drive, changes his techno blast to the move water. It gives it the water type. So his Techno Blast, which is a 120 special attack move, which with Series 13 coming up, which is allowing you to use Mythicals, you can you sacrifice your item like a Life Orb or something to run his drives to change the type. Now, the enemy, your opponent will know what drive you're using by just looking at him. This one you could go, oh, it's a Dallas drive, but if you really don't know, it's either Dallas or Chill. But it changes his normal move into a water move, which is good. And if you do Dynamax him, it does give you the type. So it give you right now, it'd be a max strike. Now, if you give him the water drive like we did, it becomes a max geyser. That's one thing to keep in mind is it does give you the ability to set what you want for his max move to be if you're wanting to use the drives and do coverage. But that's how you get Genesis drives within Crown Tundra DLC for Pokemon Sword and Shield. If this helped you out, go ahead, leave the video a like, help everybody else know where the drives are. And down in the comment section, let me know what you think of Genesect. He is actually one of my favorite mythicals, but I'd like to know what you think about him. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.